एवरीवन होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग गुड टुडे वी आर ट्राइंग टू क्रिएट अ मॉड्यूल फ्रॉम स्क्रैच इन रूबल नाइन द नेम ऑफ द मॉड्यूल विल बी ऑटो कंप्लीट नोट सर्च दिस इज द पर्पस ऑफ द मॉड्यूल टू कन्वर्ट अ सिंपल टेक्स्ट फील्ड ऑफ एनी फॉर्म इनटू एन एज एक्स ट्रिवन ऑटो कंप्लीट सर्च टेक्स्ट बॉक्स for example uh, here as you can see anyone typing here a name and uh, the alphabet a the word starting with this alphabet a will get populated over here or the words containing this word will get populated over here so this is the idea of our module is for this we first need to uh, create a skeleton of the module and for preparing a skeleton we uh, need these uh, few basic steps like we first need to create an info.yaml file and then a routing.yaml file will be required a route for a form will be needed then a form a route for a controller and last a controller we will create so for this let's switch on to the code this is our editor and here in modules in custom folder we will create a new folder named title search this will be the name of our module then in this folder we will create a new file named title search dot info dot yaml file and we will create an another file here named title search dot routing dot yaml file okay we need to save this file basically with this name and uh, the content of the file will be different obviously so let me save this file with title search dot routing dot yaml file now in title search dot info yaml file uh, let's give a module name here title search there should be some kind of a description here for example searching for title then we need to provide the type what it is like whether it's a theme or a module so we are creating a module here so we will write here type equals to module then there is the mandatory thing that will be required in drupal 9 modules it's a code version requirement and it should be either Drupal eight or a nine. So here, so in this way, our module name dot info dot yaml file got created. Let's save it and switch on to the routing dot yaml file content. So here we need to first give a module name, then your machine name will go. Then a colon obviously for the syntax we uh, we ha we have to follow the YAML syntax to create a proper file. Then here we will go with path. Path should be anything. It's a title search for example. Then we write here defaults. Defaults. Inside defaults, there is a path of the form. The form path will be okay. Drupal, then your module name, then your form slash your class the class of the form that will be for example title search title searching for example then here we'll go the form title searching title of node then we go on to the requirements here we go with permissions and let's say get the permission of access content there's a permission not permissions and uh, let's save it now we will create a folder here new folder name src 
then there is another folder will go inside here the name of the folder will be form and inside form we need to create a new file and the name of the file will be title searching this is a class name so let's save it first this file dot php right and here we first have to give the namespace drupal then module name and form then our class name will go here title search and we will extend here an app spec class name form base and this abstract class holds three methods that we need to include here and these uh, methods are public function get form id this will return your id of the form title form then another function will be so the another function will be form build form and the third function is public function submit form right. so in order to use this abstract class we need to pass these uh, two form classes drupal core form and form base and drupal core form and form state interface and here we need to pass two parameters first is form and the second one is a form state interface dollar form state the same will be go here with a reference now here with the help of form property we will create a form so here let's say node items and the type should be this is a property of the form with the form api the type should be of text field and the title should be of searching form then we create a submit button here submit hash submit goes to submit and hash value equals to submit so this is all we have with the form properties and at last we just need to return this form also so we are returning this form dollar form now quickly switch on to our local host and here we will just refresh this page and search for title search and we just enable it up from here having an error here let's check what's happening what's the silly mistake i have done i have lose here one parenthesis open now let's save it again and just refresh it so here we have with our title search module enabled right now switch on to the route which we have created over here the name of the route is title search let's copy this from here and directly search it in the code base okay just let's refresh the cache and just 
refresh it over here here what we have our simple form gets rendered on this particular route so this is the major agenda of uh, this simple module with a simple skeleton now uh, we will just create a controller in this src folder uh, let's create a new folder with the name controller and here in the form in the controller let me refresh my folders so yes in this here uh, our new php file will go and let's the name of the file will be my title search controller okay dot php let's save it and we have to give a namespace over here drupal our module name title search our controller then the name of the class will go here title search controller and here i'm extending an abstract class extends controller base 